Good evening to you, it's Andy T here bringing you another uh, model that I've uh, just completed. It's the Hasegawa Eggplane Hughes 300 helicopter. Um, I've done something a little bit different with this in as much as I have put it inside a cookie jar. So here's the cookie jar. Uh, but better still, I've motorised it and I've lit it so it's got a full set of functioning navigation lights, instrument lights and uh, strobes and landing lights. So here we go, I'm going to turn on um, the controller, here we are, this is the controller here. It's a pickaxe controller and there's a bit of uh, circuit board here which I've made up the circuit on. This is the power supply and then uh, there's some hookup wires going out um, under the base and up into the um, helicopter itself. In the back you can see that I've put um, a, a, a sketch of our local helicopter museum. That's the helicopter museum in Western Supermare. So this is the helicopter landing pad there and here we are I'm just about to turn it on and you can see it start to go through its paces so there's the starboard navigation light on um, the strobes are starting to flash the rotors turning I'm going to turn it round so you can uh, see it there's the port navigation light the um, landing light has just gone off and I'll just put it through its paces again so that you can see the instrument panel. Look carefully by the white dot on the canopy and you'll start to see the instrument light turn on. There it goes, it's on now. And there we go, we'll go through the sequence again. Landing lights on, rotors turning. So what do you think about that? And then when I put the back on here it all seals up nice and tight and then every two and a half minutes it goes through and repeats the process all over again. Do hope you like it. Okay, please subscribe. Thanks very much indeed. Bye for now.